developing right now. We're learning more about the motive behind the killing of the son of a Chicago firefighter. Prosecutors say a failed business venture drove this man to murder. CBS 2's Jeremy Ross is live at criminal court tonight where prosecutors detailed how the deal went south. Well, the, he was inside the building behind me earlier today. The defendant that is at times looking back at friends and family as this hearing continued. Want to show you an image now of the man we're talking about. This is 34 year old Ronald Franklin. He was accused of murder and arson today. Prosecutors say Franklin has a history including drug and gun charges, but it is his business history that sparked the fatal accusations. Back in June, investigators say the 34 year old was in the process of ending his business ownership of FX Auto Spa. He was renting space in this building when prosecutors say Franklin was selling off some of his equipment. Investigators believe the victim took $2,200 from a sale and did not give it to Franklin. Days later, police were called to 79th and Ingleside as the site of the violent crime. Sources saying the victim was fatally stabbed, his car then set on fire. 25-year-old Tyler Bernicki, the son of a Chicago firefighter, was laying on the ground with several stab wounds to the chest and legs back on June 15th. He was pronounced dead at the scene. Franklin's family, as well as his attorney, having no comment earlier today, a judge ruling no bond. Live outside the Layton Criminal Courts building, Jeremy Ross, CBS 2 News.